Mother of God. Have a couple. <laughs> okay, so transport yourself back in time. It's 2001. You're on top of the world. You headed over to your local Best Buy to check out the latest PS2 and Xbox games. You head over to the DVD section, and something catches your eye. This DVD cover. Wow. This one right here. Like, can you even take your eyes off it now? It just, it, it attracts you instantly. You're all like, fuck everything else on the shelf. I gotta have whatever this is. It is so intoxicating! It, it is... uses up to two colors to tell you that this is called Gravity Angels, and it's an interactive DVD of some sort? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Path adventure. Oh, la, la. Anyway, I was attracted when I saw this on eBay several months back, so I got a brand new copy. I tore off the shrink wrap last night, and what I found was truly disturbing and kind of amazing. <laughs> I love the way that you always call these things disturbing. I think you'll be disturbed. Uh, there's a lot to say about this. It has its roots in a PC game, and the company who made it is kind of bonkers, but we'll get into that. Mm -hmm. For now, let's let it speak for itself. Oh, what does the FBI know? <laughs> From Slingshot Studio and developer Brilliant Digital Entertainment. That's literally what they're called. They bring you this. Gravity yes. Angels, Alien Discovery. Oh yeah. Alright, this is definitely... Uh... What a screen. I'm so glad I paid $24.99 at Best Buy for this. In 2001, I didn't actually do that. No, this is this is a jam. All right, I'm all in on this music. So this is a multi-path adventure game on DVD video format. So you can play this in any DVD player, from ones back in the day to brand new ones from Microsoft or Sony or whatever. I have seen multiple people say this is a David Cage game. It's very feels it has very, a very David Cage. -esque. It has an Omicron look to it, doesn't it? Mm -hmm, yeah. Mm -hmm. And the reason for that is actually this was originally a PC game. Released in 1998, shortly before the release of the DVD video version. This is an interactive movie that was notable because it wasn't pre-rendered, it was actually all rendered in-engine, using 1998 PC technology. It looks amazing, by the way! It it's... does, let's get started. Okay. I'll be stopping the action every so often so we can uh, make some decisions, but... Really, we're gonna be doing a whole lot of watching. And there's no subtitles, so perk your ears up. Okay. Yeah, let me, uh, crank it. Hey, no smoking on Jupiter. Got it, got it. I guess Pluto- oh, Pluto is this. They had to make Pluto not a planet so they could turn it into a smoking section. Yeah. Teach the conspiracy. Miller Western. Oh man. This is where the misbehaving Amazon employees get sent. <laughs> You better designer, dude. He was high on space drugs. Okay, fair enough. She didn't follow protocol. Mm, protocol was not doing space drugs. Jazz Hopper. Recombinant? Does that mean Jazz he was... Hopper? Hold the phone! Was he killed and then put back together? I guess that's what that implies. Yeah, that'll do it. Yeah, that'll she... get you sent to Ganymede. This is their story. So, you remember Soldier Boys? This is kind of like that in space. Okay. We're on Ganymede, which is a prison planet where they send all the misbehaving space marines and shit. Cool. Thank you so much to All Hail Magambo for the 16 month resub. They say I can be your gravity angel or gravity devil. <laughs> <Holy angel. laughs> Thank you. And I have not seen this movie, only skipped around in it, and it is amazing. I can't wait for you to see this. Catherine Station to David Launch Control. Wait till you see the people. Catherine Station, this is David Launch Control. Standing by. Watch out for that ore. Wow, that stunning animation on the conveyor belt. Oh, you're right, cool, Cody. Jazz Hopper is a member of uh, Blues Traveler, absolutely. <laughs> you can really play that harmonica. Good looking lava. Mm -hmm. For ah, look. <laughs> looks like it looks like lasagna. It does. Oh my god, that's delicious. Where's Garfield? <laughs> They're putting it on the conveyor up to his mouth right oh. now. Oh god. 
<laughs> you make it sound like Garfield's like Galactus, just waiting in space. Yeah. To they devour. Keep, they keep him on a prison planet. <laughs> That's where Macaw's uh, two kilogram lasagna comes from. Yeah. <laughs> Attention all airborne and orbiting traffic. This is Ganymede Air and Space Traffic Control. All orbiting and airborne traffic to clear slug launch path. Repeat, all orbiting and airborne traffic to clear slug launch path. Surface to orbit slug We got a bunch of lava or some shit. We got, we got 12 tons of lasagna to bring over to Ganymede to Space Garfield. I repeat, 12 orders got, of lasagna for Space Garfield. We got some real hungry streamers to feed. <laughs> Pow. Thank you, Lady Lee. Linalia for the 30 per month resub. Holy shit, Lady Lots Linalia. Of yeah, they say, mm, lasagna planet. Yeah, yeah I'm excited to eat we'll here. Thank you. On the slug, retrieving now. This is how shipment works in the future. It's kind of like Lodestar on Sega CD, believe it or not. Ganymede ANST. Needs more space truckers, though. It really does. It really, really does. And orbiting traffic. All air and space lanes are clear. What? Could this be? What? Okay, okay. I was. Oh, it was just a logo. All God right. damn it! I thought it was gonna be a horrible giant space alien. Look All at right. I. And here's our first decision point, and this is where the interactivity comes in. Uh, it, first, it gives you the opportunity to skip like halfway through the movie, which is pretty nice because otherwise it doesn't have any kind of save feature. Uh, for now, though, we're just gonna start at the beginning with Alien Discovery. I was so excited, man! I thought we'll get big... to Ty's story. Okay. Well, I mean about the buff angel. I, was, yeah. I, I thought that you know they were gonna eat the lasagna or something. <laughs> is it literal? Is it figurative? Well, did you ever notice how all the good stuff happens before you're born, like really wicked rock and roll and unsaturated fats and wind-up toys? Yeah. Ten years ago, Ganymede was the place to be, Miller Western's greatest mining operation. Now it's a hole, leased to ragtag colonists. The place you get sent if you you're can't really call yourself stupid. ragtag. <laughs> Second chance, they call it. More like last chance. Now for 12 lousy months, we get to call it home. <laughs> Again, this is real-time game footage converted to DVD video, and it looks fantastic. Okay, this is the last one. Tell me when you're ready. I'm dying, Daddy. These faces. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, that was a space stoner. I, I support it. <laughs> we'll get to meet him soon. I have nothing to say. Danny can, yeah. Danny can mention my face looks like colon D right now. I am just like... It's, it's a shock to the senses when you first see this. <laughs> but yeah, this is a real movie you're watching. <laughs> I'd also like to mention that this is rendered in 4x3, but the video itself is, like, letterboxed within that? Yeah! I... Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh! Uh, this was... Not... Actually, Danny, where was this made? Was this an American game? Uh, um, Eastern European? Their studio is in Los Angeles, but yeah, I think uh, it was in Europe, developed. I thought the names were Swedish or something. Uh, it's done it again. I'm not the one to ask. We see it. Be careful. It's gross. You getting anything? Uh, nothing yet. <laughs> Just poking at my texture. We see her. Damn it! I can't hold her. Let her go. Cobb. You're past your safety Warning. depth. Maximum rated depth. Jim, get your butt out of there. Just a bit more. Remember when PC no games look like this? Yes. Maximum. It was cool. Yeah. Was... James, this is an order. Sorry. She's beautiful. <laughs> All right, our first major decision point, folks. Are we going to descend or ascend? Also known as ascend. Descend. It looks like we're trending towards descend. Okay. So let's descend, baby. No ascension for us. We are going to descend into the depths. I'm gonna dive, dive. dive. Good Just, choice. I love these real time graphics. Yeah. It's, it's very time. striking. I can see her. The hole's going. Just a little bit. What the heck? What's going on? There's something weird here, Cobb. <laughs> I 
<laughs> oh no, oh. a texture! Watch out! That's two frames of animation, Captain. Warning. Maximum rate of death. Get out of there. I, I've lost the controls. Oh, no. Hob, she's back. She can't be. The probe's cactus. Check your monitors. Listen Some alien making fun of us. You've got to get out of there. A uh, fun get fact about this game. Yeah. <laughs> the devs of this game helped develop Kaza. That Kaza. Yep, they were involved in fi file sharing for sure. Oh boy, that's so that rocks. This whole so, thing rocks. We want to go to Ty's story, or do we want to find out more about the cargo? I'm kind of intrigued by the the man with the nose ring over there. But yeah, I, I wanna, it's up to y'all. Cargo, cargo, death, cargo, cargo, cargo. We gotta see. We're the going cargo. with the cargo. Okay, let's find out more about this cargo we're carrying. Um, what I understand, cargo fast. Oh, very good, Alex. Play it back. Cargo, cargo. This is what happens when I don't stream for a week. I think you're gonna like uh, this new friend we're about to meet. I'm excited. Is that? Is that a pair of? Okay, I thought that was like a pair of lips on the uh, bottom there. It was like, hey, hey, everybody, I'm a cool spaceship. Wow! <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah! This rocks! <laughs> he's, a, he's a big fan of the space drugs. Look at all those space muffins! He's gonna get high and eat all of them! Yes! Oh, I am... He's I just am... putting his face up to it. Oh, that's his hand. <laughs> I am peeking the mic because of the space stoner. I think we have a new mascot. Okay, so we're gonna go with uh, this guy's history. We're gonna go directly to the cryogenics, <laughs> or should we head back over to Ty's story? I don't know. I mean, I kind of want to know a little bit more about this guy. He uh... had such a great introduction and all. All right, chat seems mixed to be learning about the guy. Okay, no, they want to know his history. Okay. Some people want to cry drinks, they want to know his history overall. We'll, so. we'll get to a lot of stuff eventually. There's some paths we won't see, but a lot of the stuff at the beginning we'll eventually see. So let's go ahead and see this dude's history. I love him! officer to revive all organic crew. This was the guy who got sent here because he designed defective equipment because he used too much space drugs. <laughs> I think he was the first one listed in the intro. Danny, I, I hate to say it, but I think I am what the kids die. call kidding nice with this guy. <laughs> he's an early model. We got dozens Not like this one. Don't know why, but his genetic recombination is brilliant. One of my greatest successes. Brilliant for us. Not so brilliant for him. Well, so long as he takes his shots every three hours, he can live an almost wow. normal life. Almost. <laughs> so it's decided, we let him live. But just put him somewhere he can't do any more damage. So he's an engineered space oh. drug stoner. Oh, not again. We've decided to overlook your latest indiscretion, Jess. In fact, we have a presentation for you. The dream. Show them how you feel. Give me a kiss, Phyllis. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> okay, first of all, thank you so much to Fidget for the 15-month reset. Fidget says, I can't wait for this to be my future. Danny, what the fuck? I, uh... What the... <laughs> these are some good-ass <laughs> faces right here. All right, we heading to cryogenics, or are we going to go to Ty's story? I'm not sure at what point in the story each of these is, so we're just kind of flying blind here, but whatever it is, whatever we pick, it's going to be some good stuff. Oh, thank you, Rusty Retro, for the 30 month, 31 month reset. Rusty asks, what have I walked into? I don't know. I don't know. The future of DVD video. Cryogenic time. Fuck Ty. Cryo, 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 cryo. Okay, no, nobody cares about poor Ty. Eat shit, Ty. The uh, presumptive protagonist of the story. Nope, we're going to go with the uh, space druggie. <sighs> Oh! Oh, fuck! His team! Guess we're a little closer to the dream, huh? You still want to go with this guy? 
Okay. Well, we we made our decision. He's gonna be uh, in the cryo lab. Shout out <laughs> to David Cage. <laughs> cool hat. <laughs> he bit out his top row of teeth. <laughs> Okay, so here is where you get to decide who to revive and take on your journey. Uh, this is a lady. I think it just said her name was Kelly. Mm -hmm. Do we want to go to the next cryogenic chamber, or do we want to directly revive her? I think we get multiple people we can revive. Let's see, get a couple more messages here. Let's see. Uh... <laughs> revive everyone but Ty. <laughs> Swipe left. Uh, keep scrolling. Should we keep scrolling? Revive, revive. It, it seems to be tied, so you know what, Danny? It's up to you. I'm gonna continue. Okay. Doctor, Keep scrolling. Swipe left. <laughs> Meh. Put her back in. <laughs> okay, how about this fella? It says he's been in there one year, I guess. Man, that is a face down there in the lower right. Are we gonna revive him, or are we gonna keep scrolling? It's looking like we're gonna revive this guy. Yeah, yeah. I want his animated face. Revive, bring him out. Yeah, That's true. I do, I do want to see how this face animates. So let's go ahead and... It's your lucky day, mister. You're getting revived by the space drogie. Oh, has Docky Walkie been sweepy weepy What? Not much of a talker, huh? <laughs> go back to sleep. That's my <laughs> reaction. That's me. You're a genie. Genetic recombiant human. I am one of the first and one of the past. Well, then what are you doing here? He's Ventura. I, I guess so. Uh, just stay away from me, okay? You better oh, I saw in the chat actually. Uh... Sir, toxicity looks pretty high. Probably got loaded before cryo. Oh, you a doctor as well? No, toxicity is <laughs> my hobby. <laughs> the team who worked on this uh, also oh, did a 3D Ace Ventura oh, game. So my God. He's looking. Is that Ty? I think this is Ty, and this is where we get a chance to learn a little bit more about him, or we can just swipe on past him, or learn about company orders, whatever that may be. All right, check challenge. Do you think Ty uh, bit someone's teeth out? That was weird, right? That that's, was weird. That's not something I've ever seen in a video game before. No Ty content. Continue, continue. Learn nothing. <laughs> I'm seeing a mix of company orders and continue here. Bollocks, Ty. I fucking agree with that. No more Ty. Yeah, you know what? This is my story. Ty doesn't have to be a part of it. We'll go ahead and continue. We to the tours three. Well, we're all here for something, Doc. Even you. Ooh, radical. Okay, Frappe mentions this was actually, uh, these were all meant to be separate webisodes streamed online as in five to ten minute, uh, bits. Wow. Quibbies, you may say. <laughs> the first quibby. Quick bites. The first quibby was Gravity Angels. Okay, we're back to the, the first lady here. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and see her history. Jacob. See if she's someone we should revive. Or leave her to rot like Ty. Y'all know nothing about Ty. You've already decided that you hate him. That's it, baby. Come on. You know uh, he wants it. Come on. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's not Friday. I don't appreciate you going over my head, Felice. You fake those tests and people are gonna die. The company disagrees. What? Given the release dates for those new drugs, they've endorsed my approach. Over my dead body. You can register your complaints from Ganymede. You wouldn't dare. I need to know if there's an increase in amoeba during the moon's conjunction. Well, there are dozens of people who could do that. But you're so conscientious, Felice. I'll only have two days after I Don't get knock there. On the I tank. can't do all that. Fish hate that. Then you'll just have to wait <laughs> for the next conjunction of the moons, won't you? Twelve months. You're marooning me in that hellhole for twelve months? Take plenty of books. Wake up, tube steak. <sighs> Come on, wake up. This guy's really done a job on himself. He's slapping the shit out of time. What? <laughs> 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 keep slapping him. Yeah, keep going. Get his ass. <laughs> He's Correct. upside down. I think we found our preferred character here. <laughs> no booze before snooze. Do I know you? Is this man all right? As soon as he remembers his name, he's going to be fine, Doc. Well, it ends up we had to revive everyone, so choice is an illusion. Just like in real life. Alright, chat wants to see Ty getting slapped on loop here. <laughs> this guy's legs are too long! Did you see his legs? It's disgusting! Must be related to that guy from Lunacy. Brief research party for assignment. Proceed directly to Ganymede base. 
Okay, what are we doing here? Are we gonna let Ty pilot the ship? Are we gonna see his story? Don't you want to see his story? Come on, this is your third chance to see his story. Or are we gonna let the lady take charge and pilot the ship? Uh, doctor pilot the ship, fuck Ty, girl pilot, uh, lady pilot, pilot ship, girl pilot. I see I see a couple Ty stands, but I also see some <laughs> Ty anti stands well, here. Well, Ty stands are being drowned out by mm -hmm. people who want to see the lady pilot the ship. <laughs> All right. Oh, do I need a drink? I'm supposed to be the main character. I'm amazed you can even see. Solaris to Callisto for. He's a drunk, I guess. <laughs> it's rock. She does seem competent compared to everyone else, so probably the best choice. Yeah, we're gonna just shove Ty into space. <laughs> Make him walk the space plank. <laughs> Orbiting Ganymede space traffic. This is Ganymede air and space traffic control. Cross check with SatNav. All orbiting space traffic to clear Catherine Station slug launch path. Repeat all orbiting space <laughs> Love his future hey, flask. Fucking huh? space path. whiskey. He had it in his arms while he was cryogenically frozen. Cryogenically. It's his emotional support liquor bottle, okay? Yeah. About time, Solaris. You Had this with me since our... kindergarten. Right, been ready to roll. FedEx access approach to 018. Sorry, Niner. Piss off. Solaris. Sorry, not you. Wow. Did you do everything <laughs> by the book? I do not do everything by the book. Y'all picked right. I Step love her. Away. Engage safety lockdown. I love when their expressions suddenly change. There's no transition whatsoever. Solaris to Callisto 4. Please deploy cargo. Mmm, give me some of that good lava. In granola bar form. Next time it's amateur hour, you all let us know. So, based on what you've seen, do you want Ty to take charge? Give it a little bit of a man's touch? Or do you want the lady to continue piloting the ship? Uh, I see. Continue, 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 continue. I mean, Ty has shown continue. such great leadership, uh, throwing continue. his liquor flask across the cabin of a space vehicle. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, let's uh, let's let's, uh, sure let's, let's continue on our path. Firing line of the rail gun. Have fun. <laughs> Ty's not looking great in this playthrough so far. Maybe he'll redeem himself. I'd forget the rule book if I were you. Start your prep. Attention, all orbiting Ganymede space. Did you say friggin' prep. Yes. <laughs> I love her. By space the way. Preps. Clear slug launch path. Base slug launch in T minus ten. Mark. Space Goss versus Space Preps. <laughs> <laughs> well... <laughs> the choices are here, right on the screen. Should we freak out? Or Prisoner Reese? There's no verb there. Freak it's out, just, freak out. Uh, Alright. Do people want to freak out? People want to People want to have a... It's a psychobilly freak, freak out. Yeah, Let's do it. <laughs> yes. When in doubt... Freak out. Whoa, this isn't good. <laughs> oh, I'm drunk as shit. Request permission to freak out. Space traffic. This is Ganymede Air and Space Traffic Control. All orbiting space traffic to clear Catherine Station slug launch path. Repeat, all orbiting space traffic to clear Catherine Station slug launch path. Pod secured, out of here. Just one problem. Base slug launch in T minus 10. It'll miss us. Start deceleration now. Hey, trust me. Wow, Ty. Mother of God. Have a couple. <laughs> I did not expect to see PS1 era vomit to come right towards us in 3D. Trust you. Right. Oh man, that was whoo, crazy town. <laughs> crazy town. My favorite band. You're my butterfly, sugar baby. <laughs> <laughs> this might be the best thing we've ever played. I have you now. Degenerate. <laughs> I'll consider it a pretty controlled freakout. I she threw up, but come on.
Oh, nice clipping. Danny, whatever you paid for this game was not enough. This is incredible. <laughs> it was literally like $3.50. <laughs> Footage devoted to landing and acquiring cargo for whatever reason. I mean, aren't you interested in space logistics? No, I want to. <laughs> I want to hang out with these freaks some more. <laughs> you just want to see the freaks flip out. Yeah, I'm I here for the freak that. show. Look at that. We'll need a distraction. Keep them away from the dive room. Too easy to mess up. Not a word about this, Clay. Welcome to Ganymede. Jazz, we're gonna have to make you a life member. <laughs> you okay, Green? Here's my duty manifest. You'll notice my priority. I'll be diving in an hour. Yeah, well, could be a problem. Ain't that right, Cobb? And who might you be? Green. <laughs> this head's so jittery. Which I outrank you? And this isn't a matter of rank. Tracking camera technology really premiered in Goodfellas. All you. led up to you this. <laughs> our submersibles are being retrofitted. Sorensen here is our engineer. He all right, what are we going to do here? You got another chance to see Ty's story. Ty's story is something super important. This is something like the fourth or fifth time they brought it up. Or we can cut to the chase and have everyone team up and solve, I don't know, whatever with the teamwork. Or do you want the lady to go it alone? Uh, it seems pretty mixed between team and alone, but I think it's trending towards team? Well, we work well together. Uh, that one guy can throw his liquor bottle around. The other mm -hmm. guy can force feed us some muffins and make us vomit. I like that. Yeah, yeah this is a team. good. This is a good team dynamic. And yeah. The access corridor is damaged. Kind of the question, I'm afraid. The whole scene where the vomit happened, like a million things happened in the space of five seconds. I'm gonna mm -hmm. have to rewatch that. Oh, it's it's the bar from Deep Space Nine. There's Quark. Oh, he's looking great after plastic surgery. Excuse me, who's that? No, no. Sir, your uniform does not fit. Pan the please, camera back. Please uh, contact your superior officer for fitting clothing. What's that polygon that... Yeah, look at that. Yeah, See? I love that. It just, what are you just doing? pop in. Oh. <laughs> Do you need a refill or... Seeing how bad the damage is to the corridor that leads to the dive room. All I need is one dive. I take a couple of amoeba samples, make my report, and I'm on the next transport home. You heard what Green said. The corridor's damaged and the subs are out of action. Still drinking! She's the only one who knows what she's doing. No, I don't trust Green. Your lock code has changed since I was here last. According to this, the corridor's a no-access zone, and the door in the dive room's been sealed from Green's command section. All I have to do is open that, and I'm in. And the boy Wonder here is going to open that door for me. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, how badly damaged can that corridor be? At worst, it's lost internal pressure, so we wear vac suits. We? Oh, and when did this become a group effort? As for the subs, should <laughs> when be I a picked group effort. An engineering <laughs> genius like you. Come on, what's the worst that could happen? You get me killed? Getting sucked outside to a surface wind of 20 knots, sub zero temperature, and toxic atmosphere? Yeah, you could die. This old piss green off. Count me in. All right. Well, this should do it. Oh, oh, now all we gotta do is get to the dive room. <laughs> Fine. That's all. I get one of them butterfly keyboards. <laughs> he did. Those are expensive now. What is are they? Story? I don't well, know. That sucks. She was assigned to Green Security Team, but he's got her doing latrine duty. What a waste. I guess the good doctor needs our help. I'll get killed. And I'll get us a little more muscle. I'll get killed. We'll see. <laughs> Hey, the, his bottle really does look like a bottle of syrup. Maybe, maybe he's just, uh... <laughs> it's, his, it's his, uh, Mrs. Butterworth's supply. Mm -hmm. Police, the door's been welded shut. We're on our way. Gordy, man, how is it hanging, you big, hunkin' metal piece of thing? Got you, got you hauling rocks down to mining, huh? Well, don't worry, I'm here now, and things are gonna be a whole lot better, just like last time. Oh, oh he, he loves his robot. I can kiss it. I'm sure you can. Rip out its teeth. I figure the sooner we get you off Ganymede, the easier it'll be for all us mere mortals. Yeah, and we'll put a little critter up the company's butt. Okay, what's your point? <laughs> uh, Excuse me? Get tired, Please don't do that, the sir. <laughs> These options it keeps giving us. So, do we want a Folks. killing frenzy? Or... Never have the choices been more clear. <laughs> nuke the door. Killing frenzy. Kill nuke 
kill, or nuke, nuke door. Nuke, kill, 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 nuke, kill. Okay. The people want both of these. These these both seem pretty bad to me, but I mean, uh, well, do you see more kills or more nukes? It genuinely seems tied. Mm. I for every kill there's a nuke, and every nuke there's a kill. So, okay, you wanna you wanna rock paper scissors? I'll I'll represent a killing frenzy, and you represent setting off a nuke in a, a closed space. Right? Okay, it'll be one, two, three, go. You okay, ready? ready? One, one, two, two three, three, go. go. <laughs> uh, <laughs> we both, we both rock. we both threw rock. One, two, three, go. Alex picked paper. It's killing frenzy, baby! We get the killing frenzy. Okay, so what's plan it's B? maybe an early ending for the Gravity Angels crew. Jazz, can you offline a safety Now, just a minute. Hey, trust me. Worst case, what do we got? RKF. Robot killing frenzy. Reese, seal the airlock and equalize pressure with outside atmosphere. Let's do it. Sure, just distract Gord for me. Robot, tear open airlock door. Unable to comply. Behavioral inhibition. Protocol 3. Robot, tear open airlock door. Unable to comply. Behavioral inhibition. Protocol 3. That is as good as I can do. Well, here goes nothing. Let's kick it. Robot, tear open airlock door. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Jazz, kill it fast. Jazz, Gord! Its name's Gord. No, Gord! Okay, this is it. Gord, tear open the door. Oh, poof. I voted for killing frenzy. Where's the killing frenzy? Yeah, where's killing? The corridor's not damaged. It's not there. Well, this ain't Kansas. They well, it's, it it's interactive, but it doesn't necessarily do what you want. I guess we're gonna have to walk. Gort, attach- What are we doing here? Are we fire firing a grapple? Or are we attaching safety? I hate safety, personally. But I love grappling hooks. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's just me, though. Don't let me, uh, color your decision. Uh, people want the grapple, so I see fuck safety- f I've seen three different fuck safeties, so we gotta grapple. oh yeah, this yeah. is grapple town. Fuck safety. It's time to grapple. It's a safety line to the dive room and return. Why, Ty? He can shoot it out there with his grappling gun. Yeah. Listen to the stoner. Mm -hmm. Gord, please aim grapple pin. Still waiting on that killing dive frenzy. Door, Jazz, reset the safety. Later. Gord, Maybe that comes later. Fire Maybe. grapple pin. Needs work on its aim. Engage winch. Well, maybe, maybe, maybe if I waited, it would put a little bit of Hey, relax, Jazz. I'll fire it manually. No, you guys are useless. I'll attach the safety line myself. <laughs> Someone want to reset this thing safety codes? The lady took over the narrative no, from no, us because we don't know any better. She's like, no, no, okay. no. Come on, come on. Take this. Civilians. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Kel. What if Sega CD games did that? Like, no, no, I'm taking over. You don't just ah, you okay? God. No, no, wrong decision, yeah, folks. The storm's getting bigger. <sighs> oh, you can feel the tension. Look at that one Look at take... those models go. Look at those like 3D models go. <laughs> looks like one of them's carrying a bow and arrow. I think it's it looked like a giant steering wheel to me, but I guess that's a safety. Gonna have to enter survival mode, killing stuff with a bow and arrow. Alright, Otto calls this the Final Fantasy VI opening. <laughs> it pretty much is. Heading to the mining town of Narsh. They found some kind of, what you call it, Esper? <laughs> the door's frozen over. Stand clear while I bust the ice loose. Watch yourself. <laughs> More grunting. Restoring pressure and oxygen. Thanks. Now we can breathe in here. Retrofitting the subs. Yeah, right. 
Ooh, can you can you hack us Voice up some more subs? Jacobs, mm. F three zero one. Want a foot long? Thank you. I was thinking like Twitch subs. Oh, that's like, like five, six thousand will do. Let me try. What are you doing? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. What? So they're dead now, right? Oh. Hey, you can't. It's not accurate enough. It's tie her faceplate up. It won't close. I'm firing the grapple pin out to you. Attach it, and I'll hold her back in. It's not accurate enough. That seems like a good plan. I'll take it out for personally. Well, team rescue or jazz solo? Well, I do love jazz solos in general. Uh huh. But. Um, let's see, chat, and I see that we have some, uh, we have some jazz fans, and, uh, jazz, 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 oh, I see a sax, too, solo jazz, jazz, okay, there All we right. go. Alright, it's time for my jazz solo. Okay. Here it goes. Clear, jazz. I know what I'm doing. Prepare for a 15-minute jazz odyssey on the soprano saxophone. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> huh? Take your time. It's all right, man. Someone's uh, suffocating in an atmosphere they can't breathe. That's it's fine. Stop and observe. <laughs> Oh, is this the plan? I thought they were going to use that to wrench her helmet back into place. Wait, it's fixed now. Wait, why are they doing this? Like, what no, are they this, doing? Is, this is unnecessary. They're just bonking this poor lady around. The helmet's like a, fixed. Like a rag doll. Jazz. This is the worst jazz solo ever. Pivot right. Okay, now wrap it around the walker's legs. <laughs> I'm sorry. You enjoyed that. Uh, it's small pleasures. Okay. Yeah. Yes, I did enjoy that. Someone open that door on this tie. Sabotage. Rubbish. Company losers looking for an easy way home. No, no, cop. There's serious charges. I'll definitely look into it. You know, Green, you could really get to piss me off. Ooh. He said the P word. Piss, piss count? Two. <laughs> I think that's the only cuss they're allowed to say. I, I, I'm sorry, I, I am just enthralled. Yeah, this is the best movie I've seen in a long time. Mm -hmm. They went to the surface on a planet and tried to go inside, but they were rebuffed. What's they... gonna happen next? And when are they gonna get to the space lasagna? Precious space okay, lasagna. This is the last section of the corridor. All right. <laughs> yes, exactly. This game is rated T for tie. <laughs> last section of corridor. Are they building an FPS level? <laughs> Kel, you have a position. Build Doom 3 in real time. Okay. Easy. Easy. And. A little bit sexual. Calm, calm it down. Ty! You're okay. Just the ice compacting. He's down. Salt is harder than I thought. Yeah, that's why they sent us here. I wasn't sent. I volunteered. <laughs> You go ahead, uh, head back, I'll finish this. That's shocking, I guess. This is a place for, uh, space prisoners, though. Dude, that thing needs four windshield wipers. That's how big <laughs> it is. We still building this thing? 
Just Hold drop on. it. Hold on. Why are we even building this? So, did you know there are other games in the series? And one of them's even on DVD? That's the twist. Oh. There's actually four games in this series. What? So we better keep watching. Oh god, no! If we really like this, I can get the other three DVDs. But that's up to y'all. Hmm. This is a four chapter series. Because it's just so enthralling, right? I mean, I love... <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. This is the... <laughs> Somehow, I have the feeling it's going to come down between two choices here. But, first of all, we have Zap. We have okay. Angel Research. And we have um, Censored. Um, I have to say... Chat wants one thing and one thing only. And they're a bunch of fucking freaks. Danny? Yeah. It's time for Censored. Let me put my head. I pulled out my headphones because I was laughing so hard. Well, I guess I don't have a choice. Mm -hmm. Get your Rolos ready, because we're about to head into the censored zone. There we go. This is rated T for teen. I, it's not going to be any nudity, but still. I still expect it to be sexy. Ah! And it is. What is this? Command, master. I don't know. <laughs> oh, he's watching Walk space porn. Pillows, maybe. <laughs> Good. He's watching the cyber webcam! Oh no. I downloaded the wrong porno after off of Kazaa. <laughs> I was gonna say this porno is filled with, with uh, bugs, man. Who's been watching that porno? Oh, I love the way her. That like, makes me want to drink. <laughs> you get some more syrup in me. Old-fashioned Canadian hard maple syrup. Oh, he decided not to. Oh! A turning point for Ty. Emotional growth. Proud of you, Ty. That's mm -hmm. real hard. They did it without words, too. Dang. Up oh, yours, Spielberg. <laughs> I fixed the corridor. You've got access to the dive room. Who is she? Oh, now everyone's watching his porno. His worst dreams have come true. This signal's infecting every computer in the complex, and it's not coming from the base. Oh, I didn't download it, God. it just appeared on my desktop. If this isn't real, she's not human. <laughs> what is Sorry. she then? I thought she looked like Margaret Thatcher for a second. <laughs> <laughs> she's back and she's pissed. Whoa, hey. Who are you? Looks like someone's diving to find out. Green and Cobb. This is why they pulled the corridor apart. To stop anyone investigating. Yeah, now we know. Come on, let's find out what's going on here. Oh, so need, some, need some steady hands there? My samples will have to wait. An alien life form. That's so much more important. It's every biologist's dream. Look at that, Ty. One perfect sub. Oh, look at these readings, man. It's definitely down there, whatever it is. What is coming? it? Just try and stop me. Can you handle green? Okay, oh, yeah, did I miss Elf? I was looking at chat for a second, and now they're hollering Elf. I regret this. I hope we get to see another shot of Elf. There's gonna be people in control. First thing they teach you. There's Wish no this camera was in control. <laughs> what would I do with it? Yeah, right. Folks, what'll it be? Do we want to deceive this lady who just karate kicked a, a wall and a crowbar came out, or do we want to threaten? Actually, who's doing the threatening and who's doing the deceiving? I think the lady with the pipe is threatening, and the lady with the mask. Oh, good, good job. Is uh, deceiving. So, threat, deceive, deceive, threat. This is really mixed. Um, yeah, it's not really clear who's doing what. We're just having to deal with like what one word may mean as opposed to the other one. So it's really like fifty-fifty here. Okay. So what do you think? It's up to you, Danny. Do you want to threaten with a pipe or deceive with a face mask and do your social distancing? Well, All right. I'm seeing it trending more towards deceive. So okay. It's... Yeah. That, as as per current events, I have to. I gotta be the adult here and tell you, yes, you should wear your mask and yes. deceive. 
You're deceiving the pandemic. Look, maybe there's another way to do this. Please. Please. You haven't seen White Rat, have you? Uh, no, why? Disease control experiment that escaped. What kind of disease? Hemorrhagic genericosis. Deadly. She, there was, well, she, she said there was a rat? Mm, I think it was a disease. Maybe we should wait outside. Hey, I'd leave the entire building. <laughs> yeah, threaten and deceive okay, or deceive yeah. that threaten. <laughs> Thanks for doing this. I couldn't have you flying blind. You got the rap yet, Jess? Come on, come on. Just sit over there, Doc. Everyone's always so casual. Everyone said? Nearly. Just go. <sighs> Reese, we're out of here. Ah, the crane's jammed. Does nothing in this place work? Hold on, I'm gonna drop her. <laughs> Sorry, just yep. bonk. Just drop it. Oh, okay, the lady said there was a white rat with a fake disease going around. All right, cool, mm. cool. I think she was just lying, God, trying to get our hopes up. The, the sieve part. Jazz, you want to give me image from wherever that signal's coming from? Feeling lucky? I feel lucky. You getting that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, static. Just what we... Will it be spy probe or sabotage? I like those both. These uh, these options, I'm noticing a trend here. They don't really give us enough context to decide either, any of these. Like, I guess these are important, but we'll only find out after we make the decision. Alright, probe, probe, sabotage. It's, it's mixed here already. It's a spy probe, not... yeah. Okay, spy probe. Can we sabotage the probe? Ooh, Ooh, that's lateral thinking. That'll get you promoted. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, all right. Another 50-50 mix. I'm going to go with, um, you know what? Mm -hmm. Listen to all y'all. Yes! Record everything, yes! no matter what. Watch yourselves. I should have gone with him. I love the wall textures. Mm -hmm. Is that a model of the submarine we're in? It's a baby submarine. Oh, it's an angel! Oh. What the hell is that? Jess, getting hairy. Maybe another hundred feet. We've come this far. You sure we can handle this depth? Well, you know me, Mr. Understatement. Look, we've done what we could. Mr. Understatement. Ty. What the... Whoa, what was that? What the piss? Yeah, they stop saying piss. Bring it back. Yeah. Jazz. Uh, how would I know? Oh, the mini-me's fucking with us. Somebody sent a probe after us. It's probing us. Yeah. What am I looking at? You know, I keep saying that. I have no idea what the fuck is someone, going uh, on. Someone update your Voodoo 3 drivers. <laughs> Get your systems up. They're up. The dang things just appeared, man. Yes, this is a PS5 exclusive. <laughs> yep. You're getting the, the top... Uh, You'll play this by the end of the year. Mm -hmm. Getting a sneak preview here of the hottest game of uh, 2020. Chapter 1, anyway. Mm -hmm. Chapter 2 is coming in 2021. A whole lot of sitting, ideas. sitting and looking. Sure. Get off us. I don't like the sound of that. Little bastard. Ugh. That's bad, right? Fleece. Oh! Two seconds. Uh, that looked bad. Ty has a metal arm. And uh, things are happening. Yeah, shake it off. No, don't do there. it. 
what are we going to do? This little bastard's trying to drill into our submersible. Are we going to counterattack? Are we going to battering ram? What do you think is more likely to help us survive this situation? <laughs> if it were you, trapped in a submersible uh, vehicle... Chad is... Battering ram, battering ram, batter, 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 ram. No, uh, we will never go to the surface. We will constantly batter that ram. Like okay. A beautiful it, piece of chicken. It's looking, it's looking like battering ram is battering winning. Ram. So let's do it. Let's, let's batter that ram. Nice. Ooh, poor Ty. Damn. Hope he had a drink in him before that. Release. Ram the probe against the rocks. Wait a minute, it was a metal hand. It couldn't have hurt. What? Whatever. <laughs> they, they installed nerve sensors in it because they're assholes. This is not sexual. It's not, Danny. Definitely not. He's not going to be able to hold it, man! <laughs> what the... They... Mmm, that's the good stuff. Mm, how to put in some drugs. Now what? It's not ours. Will you just stay away from that police cow? <laughs> that's me. <sighs> We're like 20 feet underwater, right? Can't we just swim up? Did we suddenly dive like 20,000 leagues under the sea? I hope someone throws up again. Oh, nice work. Of course, I never had any doubt. Oh, uh, okay, we battered. Uh, Ty, you okay? Um, my hand has a hole in it, Felice. I've got to get you both to medical. Whoa. What is it? That's what I'm saying. The most beautiful thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Damn, <What>? lady! <laughs> that's, that's not my first thought, but all right. Oh, it's so beautiful. <laughs> You're right, Cameron. It's a real player skin. It is. Is that it? I can't. We did it. Oh, wow. That was a whole ass hour, too. Beautiful. That's, that's literally how it ends. Really? <gasps> oh, That's a real, yes. real Shinmu 2 ass ending right there. But all right, that's the first of four <laughs> entries in the Gravity Angels series. <laughs> Thank you for you did it. I don't know if we deserve that. Good job, everybody. Yeah. You successfully piloted us through all kinds of space disasters. People who wanted to see us fail. Uh, little bastards who wanted to drill into our submersible. We survived it all, thanks to your skill and wit. I was going to say, technically these should be we did it. But yeah, <laughs> yeah thank we you did all. It. You did beautifully. Oh my we god. We all worked together, and that's how we survived this thing. So, uh... So what's the verdict? Do we want to watch more of this? Because I don't have the other discs, but I can acquire them. It all depends on what the folks think. If you think this is a waste of time, just tell me, don't bother. But if you want to see more of the Gravity Angels series, there is more out there. Absolutely. You gotta get them. You I, do. Yeah, I am pretty invested at this point. I want to see what the hell that was. The, the most beautiful thing I've ever seen, according to that one lady. Okay, <laughs> yeah. so tentatively... I'm going to try and acquire Chapter 2 of the Gravity Angels Saga, and we'll see that at some point in the future. Apparently Chapters 3 and 4 are really rare, so uh, <laughs> I hope this Danny. is really good. It's got to be worth it, though. Yeah. It's amazing. Incredible. While these go, we got to call real quick. Okay. Uh, beautiful. Tell me, tell me if there's any, any, uh, any good, any, any good uh, credits here. Okay. Congrats, folks. Everyone survived, too. Even the space druggy, Ty, our beloved Ty. Uh, other guy who didn't have a name. Maybe he did. The guy who got slapped a lot. Oh, wait, that was Ty. Thanks to the Multipath Movie Development Toolkit. <laughs> Get three and four off of Kazan. <laughs> you know, I bet their file sharing service only exists now to, uh, to share future chapters in this. Also gotta love the, the hubris in naming your studio Brilliant Digital Entertainment. Yeah! Alright, good work everyone. We successfully survived. Uh, our progress will carry over. Our 
commanding officer will remember the decisions we made and the things we said about him? Actually, probably not. You know what? Since we're here, I'm gonna start the adventure again. And we're gonna check out Ty's story, damn it. Ty's story must be told. What's his deal? I'm back. Did the, did the angels solve the gravity problem? They did. Cool. I'm proud of them. We're gonna see Ty's story. <laughs> no! Oh, that sucks! I don't... Alright, uh, no, no, no. Ban Dan. Permission denied. I'm canceling my sub. Ban Dan. Ban well, Dan. if we're gonna see chapter two, we gotta find out what the leading man's, uh, I'm what his backstory away. is. Alright, uh, looks like we are losing all our followers. Everyone's Ty, leaving. Ty, Ty, Ty. Uh. somewhere near Alfred Centauri. So they leased Ganymede to the colonists. And the colonists continued to mine whatever osmium they could. The six of us had been sent by Miller Western to be forgotten about for a while. Kind of a punishment. That was the deal Miller Western struck. Oh, this is a summary in case you weren't paying attention. Misfits there. They uh -huh. told the colonists would be a rescue team. <laughs> There's a talking headset. So we on two counts. One, because we were outsiders, and two, because the colonists figured they didn't need no fancy rescue team. And made us stick together. Ganymede was a lonely place if you didn't stick together. Did we just well, kind of trail off all listening all to him? Stuff happens before you're born, like really wicked rock and roll and unsaturated. Is that it? And that was the entirety of Ty's story. <laughs> that <laughs> His whole backstory amounted to like five seconds of summary. Here's good news. Okay, I've had multiple people ask this. Was this done by the people who did Cyber Swine? Yes. Okay. They did Cyber Swine. They did an Ace Ventura 3D adventure game, which is different from the one we played on Multimedia Monday. Mm -hmm. And their final game, I think, was a Superman game. All right, chat's screaming for trailers. Good news, there's trailers. Okay. I'm not sure if any of these were ever actually released, but please enjoy, because I sure did. What? Imagine this, but with vampires. <laughs> I'm so sad this doesn't exist. Maybe it does. Maybe there's a prototype out there somewhere. Surprise! <laughs> Expect to see every frame of this posted on the Good Faces Twitter account in the next week. This fucking rocks! What the hell? Yeah, I I'm so sad that that doesn't exist. Prove me wrong, though. We'll play it if it exists. But they didn't just do vampires, cause they also wanted to do a movie about mummies. The mummy who wouldn't die. Faces. Nobody lives forever. Oh, I love that game. Except me, the mummy who wouldn't die. Oh my god, the mummy who wouldn't die. Ooh, there's a third one? I haven't seen this one. What is it, like Frankenstein? Danger Wolfman? Are about to Halloween party! Oh, she's when a kitty. The of evil are unleashed. <laughs> know what might happen. Yes. Vampires only come out on Halloween, and boy, are they hungry. This is one Halloween Beth and Peter will never forget. Trick or treat! <laughs> Amazing. So, if you ever come across any of those in any form, like final release, early alpha, Free development anything, please, please tell me, because I want to showcase it really, really badly. What? Danny? Yeah. Hot news. These are those, those, those. Okay. They're based. Those, those things. They're based on the Goosebumps Choose Your Own Nightmare series of books. Oh my God. <laughs> I want. Oh, I'm, I'm turning to a gremlin. I'm so excited 
excited about that. Wow. Well, that's just for the future, maybe. We'll have to see. But for now, that is Gravity Angels Chapter 1, Alien Discovery. Chapter 2 coming TBA.